Hello friends subscribe to our channel GDC and press the bell icon for more updates. Hello Pharma aspirants welcome or welcome back to GDC channel. Today in this video we will be learning about the anti-amobic drugs. Anti-amobic means against amobic. It means that ambiosis that is amobic dysentery which is an infection caused by anti-amoba histolica which is a protozoa that is ant amoeba histolytica ant amoeba histolytica it is it is a protozoan which is anaerobic is responsible for amoebiosis this disease can be acute or chronic with the patient showing various degrees of illness from no symptoms to mild diarrhea or fulminating dysentery. Amoebiasis is a protozoal infection which is caused by anaerobic protozoa that is Antamoeba histolytica. When the infection is occurred by oral route, this is amoeba. And when in human, GIT infection is caused by the antamoba histolytica, it is intestinal amoebiosis. And when this disease is occurred in liver or tissue infection, it is extra intestinal amoebiosis. Let's move towards the classification of anti-amobic drugs. AGT. Mnemonic to remember the classification. A for amoebicides for both intestinal as well as extra intestinal that is GIT and liver infection. In this class, the first subclass is nitroimidazole. Nitroimidazole. And second one is alkaloids. The drugs belonging to nitroimidazole subcategory is matronidazole, matronidazole, tinidazole, matronidazole, tinidazole, ornidazole, ornidazole. Satranidazole, Satranidazole, and Secondinazole, Secondinazole. That's for the nitroimidazole. In alkaloids, amethyl and dehydroamethyl is used. For the treatment of amoebiasis. G. For GIT infection, that is for intestinal or human amoebicide, the drugs are first one is amides, and second is antibiotics. The amides are diloxanide, diloxanide, furate, and nitazoxamide, nitazoxanide. Antibiotics which are used for GIT infection are tetracycline. Tetracycline and pe 
पैरोनोमाइसिन पैरोमोमाइसिन टी फॉर टिश्यू एमोबेसाइट्स दैट इज एक्स्ट्रा इंटेस्टाइनल और लीवर एमोबेसाइट ड्रग्स आर और द ड्रग इज क्लोरोक्वीन now some important notes about the drug the first one is metronidazole which is nitroimidazole derivative some key features of this drug is that it has broad spectrum activity broad spectrum activity and in the presence of oxygen in the presence of oxygen that is aerobic metronidazole cannot be reduced to its active metabolites cannot be reduced to its active metabolite active metabolite hence it is ineffective or ineffective against aerobes so the metronidazole is only used in the treatment of anaerobic bacteria because when oxygen is present that is aerobic bacteria are there metronidazole cannot reduce itself into its active metabolite and leading to its ineffectivity towards the aerobes now the uses of metronidazole again agt mnemonic is similar as the classification agt a a for amoebiasis and anaerobic infection it is used in the treatment of amoebiasis and in anaerobic infection second one g g for grdss and guinea worm infection used in the grdss and guinea worm infection used in the treatment of trench mouth ulcerative gingivitis trench mouth ulcerative gingivitis ulcerative gingivitis and trichomoniasis trichomoniasis use were like this agt amoebiasis and anaerobic infection giardiasis and guinea worm infection and t trench mouth ulcerative gingivitis and trichomoniasis now what are the adverse effect of metronidazole same mnemonic agt is used in the adverse effect first is that it causes anorexia and abdominal cramps abdominal cramps alcohol intolerance
for G it causes glossitis and glidius. Glossitis and giddiness. And T it causes taste of metallic taste of metallic thrombophalptis thrombophalabitis which is caused on the IV injection of the drug which is concentrated and also it has teratogenic potential teratogenic potential some drugs which are used in some other protozoal diseases first is GRDSs GRDSs is caused by GRDA GRDA Lamplica Preferred drug for GRDSs is metronidazole. Alternative drugs for GRDSs when metronidazole is not available is tinidazole. Furazolidol, Furazolidol, Secnidazole, Nitoxanide, Quinitochlor. Quinioto chlor for trichomoniasis. Trichomoniasis is a disease which is caused by trichomonas vaginalis. The drugs which are used in trichomoniasis orally is metronidazole, drugs which are used intravaginally are diidohydroxyquinine, hydroxyquin, Diidohydroxyquine and povidone iodine or quin idochlor quin idochlor that's for the diseases which are caused and treated by the antibiotics. Some other diseases are Lismaniasis, also known as Kala Azar, caused by visceral Lismaniasis. Visceral lesmaniasis caustic agent of lesmaniasis or kala azar. Antimonials drugs which are used is sodium stibogluconate sodium stibogluconate which is the first choice 
and after this meglumin meglumin or antimonate are used in diamidine pentamidine is used other drugs which are used are amphotericin b ketoconazole allopurinol maltifosin for toxoplasmosis the drugs are clindamycin clindamycin pyrimethamine and spiramycin the causative agent of toxoplasmosis is toxoplasma gondii toxoplasma gondii for trypanosomiasis trypanosomiasis which is caused by trinosoma Drosy. Drugs are suramycin and pentamidine. Suramycin and pentamidine. That's all for the the drugs used in amoebiasis and other protozoal diseases. Thank you for watching this video.